I don't know what you think, but I would think that anybody who earned his living by writing or directing would like to give Joe Mankiewicz a double Mickey. <laughs> but you just can't trust anybody anymore. Instead, for two years in a row, they went and gave him a double Oscar. An even more remarkable tribute to Joe is that because of him, children who couldn't normally spell anti-disestablishmentarianism now have no trouble at all with Mankiewicz. <laughs> now we give him his chance at the microphone to present the director's award, Mr. Joseph L. Mankiewicz. This year's nominees for Best Achievement in Directing are, and in all cases, these men directed the picture. The African Queen, Horizon Enterprises Incorporated, United Artists, John Houston, an American in Paris, Metro Goldwyn Mayer, Vincenti Minnelli, Detective Story, Paramount, William Waller, A Place in the Sun, Paramount, George Stevens, and a streetcar named Desire, Charles K. Feldman Group Productions, Warner Brothers, Ilya Kazan, and the winner. The winner is George Stevens for A Place in the Sun. Nominated in 1943 for The More and the Merrier. This time, George came home with the bacon. He is proceeding now to the center of the stage, being warmly and resoundly congratulated by Joe Mankiewicz, and now, Stevens speaks. Excluding uh, Mr. Hornbeck and Miss Head and Mr. Brown and Mr. Wilson and Mr. Waxman and Mr. Mella, I'd like to say thank you to all of those other talented people that brought us here tonight. Thank you. Thank you. 